Hey everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcoming you to episode 37 of Let's Play Secret of Mana Blind. And last time, I had no idea what the hell I was doing. This time it's not much different, but it's a whole different day, so that's something, I guess. Off screen, I tried to do a little bit of grinding. It wasn't very successful. I think someone gained like one magic level and something. So I think it was Sydney gaining like a... I can't even remember now, actually, to tell you the truth. And then, uh, we all leveled up to, like, 42. I think Sydney's actually level 43 now, so... She's the odd one out. But being the odd one out also makes her the stronger one, so... There's that. Alright. So I think the reason... A commenter told me about this. I think the reason that I was getting so confused on where to go last time... Shoot. Was because, um... I came across a conveyor belt of some sort and assumed that it was one I had already taken. I think I, th I assumed it was this one here. When in fact it was a wholly different conveyor belt. Which I guess I should have thought because like... Oh yeah, I can do that now by the way. I just I realized that because I like, got my weapon skill up to 6 in, it, in the grinding. That happened like really early on. And I was like, oh I wonder what that's like. And bam, freaking hurricane spin. I love it. I love it so freaking much. But uh... Yeah, I guess I should have assumed that because there have been multiple sets of conveyor belts in here, so I don't see why they wouldn't put another one in. These freaking Captain Ducks. I hate these guys. There's so many annoying enemies in here. That's why I was trying to grind up in the first place, to tell you the truth. Because I just... These freaking enemies, they're so annoying, most of them. And I found that the Kimono Wizard here is actually weak to Gnome very significantly. So, there's that. These guys aren't weak to anything, though. I tried analyzing them. I tried doing all sorts of things. Just have to go cold, hard steel on them. Dude. I also sort of looked through my magic menus to get reacquainted with the spells to make sure I knew what they all did. Because I realized that I haven't been using, like, 90% of my spells, so... Or, I haven't been using 90% of my skill set, really. To tell you the truth, I, I just... I don't know. I just haven't been... It's always been at my disposal. There have always been these neat things, like charging my weapon up. I don't even have to charge it up all the way. I can still just charge it up, like, two levels here be just fine. Yeah, see, that's pretty hefty damage right there. And I don't know why I've been neglecting all that all this all of the time. I also don't know why I've been neglecting all my spells. Like, even, not even just, like, I, like, I keep using the same spells over and over again. And where's that getting me? I mean, sure, it's defeating some enemies, but... Like, what if I want to buff myself up? I, like, saw some nifty spells that help me do that. It's really... There's a whole... I have, like, a whole arsenal at my disposal. And I feel like I've only just now started to notice how powerful it can actually be. And it's probably a little too late to be noticing that. Probably shouldn't have been using all this stuff all the time up to this point. But Dag Nabbit, I just... I'm just so... I just have my heart set on these weapons, man, I guess. I, I don't know. I have my heart set on some other crazy combat style that's just tomfoolery. We just need to learn the way of the game here. And I think I'm going to... Now that I think I've realized this, I think I can do better and hopefully beat this game without too much failure. Of course, failure is never a bad thing, to be completely honest. Too much failure. The, now that's, a, that's another whole different thing. But, uh, just a bit of failure on its own is something we can all laugh at. Come on, hit him again! Hit him again! Damn it. I wish I could control that more. That'd be cool. Like, if you could actually steer it. I've tried, believe you me. Oh, God, he's a wolf now! I should assume nothing less of a shapeshifter, I guess. He's gonna shift his shapes. Beast, zombie. Tch, man. They've got such manic names for all these creatures. Yeah, I figure that shapeshifter is probably not worth it at this juncture. Alright, so, yeah, the problem now is that I actually have to find where that conveyor belt that I got confused with is, so, <laughs> I think it's past this color combination door, otherwise I don't see why I would have had to open the color combination door. Probably should have just gone back and watched the previous video just to make sure I knew where it exactly was. Mm, oh, someone leveled up there. Well, that's me reaching level 44, so I guess I lied. I was, <laughs> I was level 43. I think Edge is still level 42, though. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I just missed his level up. Just like I missed Argon's level up, apparently. Uh, actually, before I do this, um, I'm just gonna 
The Kimono Wizards are pretty great for MP, I found. For sapping the life out of them. Man, it really did look like I was sapping the life out of him there. He was like straight up on the ground. I'm gonna also do... Where's Sydney? Uh, uh, is this the one I want? I like Moonsaber because it like... It lets you like refill your life with each hit. Which is really cool. Unfortunately, like, I'm still like level 0 with that. Or level 1 at the best, so... I really don't get... It doesn't last that long. Man, did that gnome really not kill you? Wow. I thought it always killed these guys. Low damage roll, I suppose. Man, look at this confined space we're fighting in. Holy cow. <laughs> I can barely see my own sword in front of my face. In fact, I can't right now. There it is. Got these metal crawlers. I tell you, I wish these guys had a weakness. I so do. But, no, they're just stuck. Dude, did I... Did that... I guess my spell maybe just didn't hit? Is that what's going on here? Or is there something else entirely? Is he reflecting it? No, it was, I thought well, it was weird. Edge sees the Reaper. Don't do that to me. Well, you know what? That's okay. Because, um... Shoot. Because this lets me show off this new skill that I learned from Dryad that I didn't even realize I had. Freaking Revive a Fire. That is so useful. Like, it's sure is expensive. Freaking 10 MP for it, but... I mean, you can't deny its usefulness. Doesn't look like it brings it back to full with full HP though, so uh, I have to fix that up just a little bit here. There we go. Uh, I want to keep her on a magic grid there. All right, is this? I hope this is the way to the freaking conveyor belts of doom and misery, of confusion and peril. Oh, hello. Please don't be a doom trap or something stupid. Candy, all right, I'll take that. I buy that for a dollar. Not that way, clearly. Uh, so I can assume it's this way. Or else, I just went... Did I, just, I think I did go in a stupid circle. Yeah, look at that. I, what's the point of that stupid color door? I... What? Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna ha have this another, be another episode where I'm wandering around the stupid freaking maze, in air quotes. Is this it? I'm gonna assume this is it. But I'm probably wrong. Wow, that's a long conveyor. Maybe that is it. Uh, well, I guess it very well must be. Well, how about that? Because I do not recognize this place. Or if I have been here, then I'll, my memory is really faux right now. Don't do that. Stop hitting me. <laughs> Stop hitting me. It's not fair. Alright, uh... I wonder if these guys have any sort of weakness. Who cares? Let's just fireball them to hell. Well, if they're dark stalkers, that probably actually means that Lumina is their weakness. But we all know, we've all seen how well Lumina's offensive magic works, so that's great. I suppose the best I could do is steal some MP from them or something. Uh, oh, did I just level up Luna there? Sweet, Luna reaches level one. It's about damn time. Mm. But you die. You di Oh god. Man, that didn't kill him. <laughs> I swung my sword at him like five times in a row there and only like one of them hit. It was stupid. Why do they keep casting Ice Saber too? They're not even hitting me with it. It's ridiculous, man. It's a waste of your and my time. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna let that guy walk into a wall all he pleases over there. And uh, see what- What the- Is this a, like a subway? What in the world? Whoa. Um. Damn. Just checking the perimeter to make sure I don't miss anything here. But I, oh god, wow, I missed you! Holy cow. But, uh, I'm gonna keep missing you. And just head, head on in. What the f- <laughs> There's freaking zombies, right? This is like totally zombies ate my neighbor style. They didn't have a subway level in that game, though, did they? That would've been cool, actually. I suppose it wouldn't have gone well with the neighborhood motif, but neither again does the pyramid level, so whatever. Oh, and I'm sorry, these are these are ghouls, so I guess it would be ghouls ate my neighbors. I don't freaking know. Now I'm just making jokes that totally aren't funny. Oh. Uh. Mm. All right. Oh, well, something leveled up there. 
Sydney reach level 44. Sweet. Yeah, Edge can't still be level 42 if me and Sydney are both level 44 already. That's just a physical improbability. Mm. What? Oh. <laughs> For some reason, I thought that those vines that were snare snaring Edge, that like speed down spell, was coming out of the chest. I didn't, and I was like, how does what? How does this magic works? Say no Twilight Zone. What? Mm, stop trying to dive bomb me. Did you see him? He's doing, he, like, I love these guys. They like, try to do a belly flop. Uh oh, he raised his critical hit ratio there for a second. But then he died, so, um. There, yeah. Alright. Man, they have lots of really good buff magic. Too bad they don't. Too bad they're not buff. Oh my god. If they had some last ability, then they'd be worth a damn. They might actually be tough enemies to beat. But candy won't fit. Well, that's a good thing to hear, I guess. I mean, not really, because it means I get cheated out of a candy, but. Oh, not. Is this one of these stupid, like, tomato guys? Or he had a, he had it last time. Eggplant man. Okay, well there you go. Well, eggplant is even worse than tomato. So um, actually I'm gonna see if he does have a weakness. Cause need lion was that? Is that like oh they're like little hedgehog things? Okay. Ah shoot I died. Oh my god I didn't even realize it. Wait eggplant. Did I finish the analysis of him? I need to, I need to see the analysis. Okay he's not weak to anything. Well that's just great. Um. I do have a couple of wishes left, don't I? Might as well use it. Don't not and not have to waste the MP here. I hope that Edge your magic will pull through. I think uh Well damn, I just totally forgot that guy's name. Salamando, that's right. I think that he's my most powerful magic force with Edge right now, so that's probably what I should be doing. But I figured that I can I figured out actually how to like chain gnome, so maybe I'll try that. It's like, oh well I didn't really do it there because I don't know. It didn't open the magic menu when I told it to. In any case, um I should probably heal up. Let's see. Yeah, if there's anything, I guess... I was checking out Sydney's magic levels, and they're all, like, all zero, except for, like, Undyne, which I guess is really good. For, like, that Undyne's that high up. But, it's... Oh, did we just walk out of a moving subway? Well, that's just great. Oh, at least the subway stopped moving. It, it, it never looked like it was moving to begin with, with me, but then the background out there was moving. So, I don't know what to believe anymore. In any case... I don't know what to, there's a, it's a freaking subway in medieval times and I don't know what to believe anymore about the logistics of it. It's like just, just shut up. There's no need to think about this too complexly. All right. I guess it's not really medieval times when they've got airships and stuff though. But they're still fighting their battles with swords and bows. So there's something to be said about that. Uh oh these are just archways. Weird little H archways. Oh, well I can't go th th All right. That was a fun puzzle, I suppose. <laughs> Whatever, man. All right, let's see. God, this really does feel like a maze, but like oh, did I just hop? Wait, did I I did I I just hopped up that ledge. I swear I did. Hold on, can I like use this to jump up there? Dude, I can. Wow, I didn't <laughs> Well, that's just plumb amazing. I probably can't jump up this one. That's why it's too high. So there's no going back, I suppose. Mm, oh, never mind. <laughs> Jeez. Right after I'm like, oh, there's no going back. Wait, a dumb found me. Oh, my. Hello. Wait, you're the boss. Yeah, you're boss. I freaking... Oh, God, this guy is so flamboyant. Uh, that's right. And I'm going to kick your ass now. <laughs> Hand it over. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm gonna do that. Please. Mm. Oh, is he not even gonna fight us? He's gonna get his little minions to fight? Super special deluxe robot type 2 with turbo! Oh, every, everything's with turbo. Is the turbo controller the turbo graphics 16? Did he say Kettlekin? Or Kettlewin? What the fuck? Uh, hello. I think I need to examine you right about now. Or analyze. Let's see, what do you got? Not much MP, that's kind of nice to see. No discernible weakness, however. Well, alrighty then. 
Uh, I'm gonna get... Let's see if I can... What if I use MP Absorb to, to absorb what little MP he does have? Uh, well, I can only absorb one at a time, so he's not prone to that, I guess. Lucid Barrier. Show sure enough. Well, this is really freaking slow. Come on, hit him. Hit him. Dude. Well, that did shit. <laughs> uh, Salamando? <laughs> That's always my fallback. When all else fails, just use Salamando and hope for the best. See, so yeah, I see 101 damage. Not too bad. Are we, like, freaking unconscious? I couldn't even see if Argon was unconscious there. It was just totally off screen. Well, technically, he was still on screen. It was just he was hidden by the foreground. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> this guy's funny. Uh, I do recognize this guy, though. He's like, the, the, oh my god, we're just lying in a huge heap of meat. Ugh. Oh, god. oh my god, Edge died. Okay. That's really not good. Ah, oh, shit. I don't have enough MP to restore him. Well, <laughs> this guy is giving me a run for my money for a second here. Okay, now let's revive a fire him, because Edge is probably going to be a key. Are you, are you kidding? Oh my god, I was not paying attention at all there. I should probably... Wait, dude. Ah, shoot. Alright, revive a fire Argon. Actually, I probably should have healed myself, or healed Sydney before doing that, in retrospect, but uh, she has time to do it now, so. Damn it, did Edge die? Oh my. I am the worst at this game! Oh, I tell ya. Well, I suppose the strategic plan now would be to revive Edge. Shit, he's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill Sydney. Alright, now. Fuck! The dude, you killed Argon! <laughs> This is just an endless loop. All right, I get, well, that could have gone better. Where is that gonna put me? I don't think I don't remember the last time I saved. <laughs> no trace of them was ever found. Uh oh, this ain't good. Um. Uh, North Town. Uh. Uh, what the? That's the wrong way. But the, the, uh, what? Wait, I. Um, I don't know what to say, guys. Um. Uh, well, meet you back there.